Hey guys, so this is my uh, Lenovo laptop and uh, like I was uh, saying in the last class that uh, to uh, go to your BIOS settings your uh, Lenovo laptop has a Novo button that you can use like a shortcut key that will take you automatically to the BIOS settings and uh, for the other laptops you can either go with the F1, F2 or F12 button that will take you to the BIOS options. So let's get, let's get started and I'll show you where you can find this uh, uh, Novo button in your uh, Lenovo laptop. So this is my IdeaPad uh, um, uh, uh, 520 uh, series and uh, if you uh, uh, go to the left hand side of your laptop you will uh, find your various uh, 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 sockets that you have your USB sockets your charging sockets and everything and if you uh, go to the right right side so here you should see a small button which uh, so two small buttons um, so one is for your uh, which uh, tells when you when you um, switch on your uh, laptop the light blinks the, and the other one on the left hand side is your Novo button so now to uh, switch on your Novo button you would need a toothpick kind of a thing that will help you to um, switch it on so what I'll do is I have uh, this uh, toothpick so what I'll do is I'll so here just long press this and you see the laptop is starting up so that's all you have to do and you can see my uh, laptop is starting so give it some time this should uh, go into my um, uh, bio settings and from there we can go and uh, do the necessary changes that will help us to install the application so I'm into my bio settings so you can use your keep uh, keypad to uh, choose the settings so uh, so you have uh, your normal startup your bio setup you have uh, boot menu and then you have system recovery so we'll go into bio setup and uh, here you have the different things so you have the uh, configuration security boot and exit so you will need to go into configuration so go to configuration and uh, here you can see you have something known as Intel virtual technology so this is uh, where your the issue is causing since this is disabled you are seeing that issue so to resolve this issue all you have to do is you have to enable this so hit enter and uh, select enable and choose that and to save this all you have to do is click on F10 so F10 yes and that's it your system will uh, start to reboot and that should solve the issue so that's it in this video and uh, in the next video i'll uh, i'll show you i'll go into my uh, virtual box and i'll show you how you can install the uh, ubuntu uh, virtual machine in your virtual box thank you uh, like share and subscribe